Thank you, dude. Get your hair out standing up. I'm outside. Come Hold right up here. to what you said, dog. I did. Yeah, road to 270. I was a fan of his and everything, and I don't want to deal with that. Now with the fake car show no more. Yeah, so I have his signature on there. I was in the first minute scratching out, but I didn't have a marker. Stacks, baby. What's up, baby? Favorite place. To the bird up there, bird. <laughs> this is who I'm meeting right here, dog. Let's see who this guy is. His name's Ryan. It's my guy Ricky, man. How's it going, Ricky? Oh my God, now you got it. I was like, touch right in his hand. I'm like, ah, shit. Uh, come on, Ricky. We want him to stay, bro. Okay. We want him to stay and work. I don't usually do that as a cameraman. All right. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to get these dudes to bring us. Oh, shit. I guess I have to pay for stuff, huh? Just a little bit. Give me 20 bags for free. Sponsor me. Yeah, yeah. Grab those, whatever you got. Then we'll go to the other one. We'll go to the back. I'll go pay for them. Four. There's five across, four high. I didn't know yeah, how. Yeah, you want to take them back towards the middle of the axle. So just yeah, just level them off. Get like two and two or something. Right. These are four high, right? So take two off of every stack and put them back. Like towards uh, like the middle or a little farther back. That way it kind of evens out the load. Right. Okay. Thank you. Kid you. Have a good one. We're going to roll out. We're going to go to Babcock. You don't know what that is. Uh, if you just want to follow me, I'll take you the fastest route. Hell yeah, appreciate yeah. your love, yeah. Big hey, Ducks. You already know, homie. San Antonio. Finally. Let's go! All the time. I saw that shit with you and Big Boy. I'm about to stab that fool. Hey man, I'm a fan of both of y'all. I believe in equality, brother. Let's go, man. All right? I ain't mad at you. Hell yeah, Let's man. Go. Everybody need love. God is good every day. Every day, baby. Have All a blessed time. one, man. God bless. God bless. Good to have you, dog. Hell yeah. I ain't mad at nobody who still wants to be cool with Big Boy. I mean, shit, why would I be? Everyone's entitled to their own opinion, you know what I'm saying? I just don't like him. <laughs> That's my opinion. But, you know, he didn't do you guys wrong. You know what I'm saying? Not yet. He didn't rob you for 3,500. You know what I'm saying? He didn't talk about you behind your back all the time and then pretend to be your friend to your face. No, he did that to me. So I had to check that shit and expose that shit. And when I did expose it, guess what? You all started to see. And the best part about it is, I did it mainly for him, because now look how humble he is. Yeah. Now look at him, I love y'all. Thank you guys, I appreciate all my fans. Never in the history of Straight Cartel or Big Boy did he ever say that he loved his fans. He didn't even use the word love, ever, in the history of fans. But now since Stax exposed him, guess what he's doing? Oh, guys, I love y'all. If Go like my pictures and comment. I'll follow some of y'all back. I'll engage more with you guys. Now I'm going to do a day in the life of Big Girl. Why? Because Joey Stacks does day in the life of Joey Stacks. And this is a mistake people make, right? In including myself. Because I was told to stay away from Big Girl, too. I was told to not mess with him. I was told that he was shady and that he screws a lot of people over. And he uses people. And then he gets rid of them. And I'm like, huh, well, you know, I don't see the guy like that. My mistake, right? Made lots of those. But uh, yeah, sometimes you just gotta listen to people, man. Just to avoid the situation happening. But again, I wouldn't have been able to go in and go undercover for you guys to figure out the real big girl. And it took me four years, four years. Undercover. The whole time I had Stax Army just boiling up inside me. And your boy got deep, deep undercover. I almost forgot who I was. You know what I'm saying? But I remember. You know what I mean? I had, I had that one wrong thing that just triggered and reminded me, oh yeah, Stax, this is what you're about. You're not about that. You're about this. You're about this. You need to tell people the truth. Because remember, I had a part uh, another part one where I wasn't gonna say anything and I was just gonna like Kind of do like Pitt and Topo like yeah, you know I just wanted to go my own way and do my own thing and, and you know, just no hard feelings, you know, it is what it is uh, But you know and then ask Ricky me and stretch did a video while we were down in Port Aransas 
We got a lot to get into, guys. You know what I'm saying? They're going off in a different direction than the way that I'm going. And uh, no nothing negative towards them. You know, the homies that I started Shrink Cartel with, most of them are gone now. Right after everything happened, and I just said, don't post that. I can't post that for my fans. I can't lie to my fans and say everything's all good, no hard feelings. There is hard feelings. Motherfucker, you owe me $3,500. Motherfucker, your trash ass talked about me behind how many people's back? And then when I asked you about it, you told me no, you didn't do it? People are like, why did you confront him? I did confront him. He told me no, he didn't do it. So, if you want to support that, go ahead. I ain't mad at you. You'll find out the hard way. <laughs> you know, when you go buy one of those shirts and you wash it once, maybe twice if you're lucky. Sometimes they're on there, you know, better than the first time. But let's uh, let's get back to positive, you know what I'm saying? Because soon enough, that guy's going to unfollow Big Girl. Call Stretch. Let's get back to work. Let's get positive. All this negative talk about liars. Scumbags. I like that word. Scumbags, yeah. I like that word. One time I said scumbag, but so I was like, scumbag. It's just, it's and like, you like that one? Yeah. It's like an old school. Let's finish up what we didn't start yesterday. I don't know where the hell Stretch is. You want to answer his damn phone? Go ahead. Uh, I'll take care of it. Like well, how many holes we got him that way? Yeah, look, um, this one right here has a big, uh, like, Anything stump with a rock, we ain't gonna, we gotta worry about none of that. Just do the holes that we can do. Okay, so, it's just these two and then one over there, that's it. Well, it's let's knock them out. Fencing, posting, digging, setting. Uh, Y'all don't need an extra hand even for the grunt work, you know? Very nah, low man. cost, man. Almost illegal, like if I ain't from here. Uh, whatever will make it work, just to make some extra money. You know? Please don't record me, though. Yeah, 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 we're good right now, bro. I okay. appreciate it. Thank right, you. Well, thank you. I, I'm very sorry to interrupt you. You're guys. good, man. No day. worries. You too. We'll, we'll, get out. We'll, we'll go backwards or forwards. And what's up with this one needs to be dug out. But it's got a shitload of dirt in it. Well, then somebody wants to just close. caved it in. Yeah, yeah, because they're all good. Okay, yeah, like we gotta we gotta make sure they're all clear. So we're gonna have diggers and coming just through and just clean them all out. You know yes, what I mean? Sir. Just to double check, triple check. Bring your diggers with you real quick. This one's supposed to be cleared out. Yeah, just do it clean. Like just take out that little loose dirt. And then this one has this loose dirt. You don't have to like slam them in there. Yeah, you can see all that loose shit. Just check it out. Yeah, just pull it out. And just go from the front. And just come all the way back to the hole you just did. They, they all have a little bit of shit. Got it. Matt's about to pull up. We're gonna dump these, set them. And then we're gonna go down, dump the more. Set them. Yeah, we can't. We can't even let them out here. Yeah. They gonna... Oh, hell yeah. All I want you to do is stay right here. Honestly, that will work because it's a little cylinder post. Yeah. It's going to be right there. Let me see this. So all I really want to do is just shave. Just right here. Yeah. Clean it up. Shave the sides. Make it look good. Because if I get it all, rock. Oop. Kill those trees. Fucking Blair Witch Project. <laughs> <laughs> Clean it up. Who got gloves? One, yeah. clean that out for me with your hands. It don't have the other side. The other side's kind of shit. Yeah, no, I saw that. So it I saw really that. It, though. it just, it's way. hard to because yeah. one hits the ground before the other one. Yeah. Yeah, I just seen that. Let me see. Yeah, yeah, Turn yeah. it sideways. See how it's bent in? If I bang this out and bang this one out and make them to where they're like yeah. a little more out as opposed to in, because right now it's like, it's like grabbing something with your knuckles like this mm. instead of your fingers. You know what I'm saying? We got four by four holes with metal posts, so we got shitloads of concrete. And we're gonna have to use rock, but I don't know how much rock we could possibly get. Scoop in there, just one scoop, you're good right there. Chunk that baby. Beautiful, start throwing rock in there. Beautiful. One more 
a shot in there, Stretch. Oh, that's a beautiful thing. Now let's rake that dirt over. We'll call it a day. The back. Yes, I do. Give me a splash of water. More rock. Put more in there. This is what? Two bags? Sure. <laughs> with rock, Stretch. Yeah. Two bags with rock. Two holes. Not good. 80 bags of concrete. Yeah, because you should get two posts. I mean, you should get three posts for every two bags. Sometimes a little bit extra over the top of that, but since these are two and three eighths posts and the holes are sized to four by fours, we're only gonna get one bag per hole probably. But I mean, I ain't gonna lie, these bitches are about to be solid as fuck. But one, you and him are gonna come with me. Joel and Ryan are gonna stay. Y'all gonna follow me back to Lowe's down the street real quick in your whip. That. If you want, man, my guys will jump up there and do it. Yeah, take the load off, man. Step down. My man, get up there, G. We'll do 10 bags each. I'm gonna make sure we get an equal workout. Bring me bring me five back, I mean, uh, 10 back here. Stack them nice. Thank you, sir. Much obliged. So, Stacks, what do you have to say when people say get as far as you can with Natty? And then they also say you That's can only get so far with Natty. That's what I did though. I went as I, I, I fucked up and took gear when I was younger and didn't know how to PCT. I really fucked up my body, but I went natural for the next 11, 12 years. Just all eating, diet, uh, training, supplements. Don't take SARMs. Everyone asks me, no, no. stay away from SARMs. You'd be better off taking a regular test booster with some Novadex. Uh, as far as from rocks or something, before you take steroids too, you know what I mean? Because that's a natural test user. You don't want to just jump into steroids if you don't need that shit. You're not older. You'll fuck your body up, bro. You want to you want to work out and train healthy, eating, diet, multiple meals a day. Like I mean, it's it's a whole job in itself. You have to dedicate like every fucking dying minute into meal prepping, uh, eating your food, even when you're at work, like. I would stop every three hours, my phone would go off, and I would just go to my food, cold or not. Boom, 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 boom. Eat my food, wouldn't take but about five, 10 minutes tops for my food and go right back to work. That's what is that, 10? I guess 10 right there. All right, let it be a minute. Take a break. Take five. Let Juan want some money, dog. Let Juan get the money. Be fair. You can't have all the money, G. Sometimes I gotta get take what you got. Juan's gotta get the money, dog. So I'm greedy, man. I'm greedy. That's my shit. We got plenty, we got plenty more like, yeah, spread 10 more out. First, we gotta tote these bitches all the way down that line. So we wanna make sure we got good bags. That's 10, 10, 20. Beautiful. I appreciate it, guys. <laughs> Two, four, six, eight, ten. Vamanos. You got two guys mixing one barrel while the other two guys one guy stumping you throwing rocks, whatever. One guy mixing a barrel, the other guy mixing a barrel, one guy throwing rocks, you leveling. You know what I mean? I could do it. That's, I, of course you can. I know you can. Let's let him level out a couple of these post stretch if you don't mind doing the barrel work. Just so, right now. Just so he gets hands on real quick in front of us, you know what I mean? I'll go with Joel with three guys. Me and you will go take care of some other business. Hey, do me a favor. On these, since there's so much rock, I want to do like a little bit. Yeah, we did a little jiggle. Oh, okay, cool. Wiggle jiggle or the wiggle wiggle? Yeah, I, I call it the wiggle wiggle stretch. I don't know the wiggle jiggle. WJ. <laughs> Let's fuck with you. Alright, grab your next grab your next post real quick. Two Let's posts out of stretch this truck. Dos, por favor. Okay. You gotta think, Ryan, we're also cleaning up the hood. You know, we're pulling all these pieces of cement and brick and trash. Ryan's trying to get swole. He's over here like smashing rocks. I in know, the dog. Let's go. Well, you trying to get swole? This is exactly how Joey Stacks started to get swole. Days and days in this, doing exactly what you're doing. And then after, straight to the gym, dog. No excuses. Unless you're like near death, then you need to take the fucking day off. But All right, let's rock and roll. Y'all meet me back at Lowe's. We're going to get 20 more bags. Stretch, I'll be back. We're gonna pull up there though. Hey, Juan, we're gonna pull up there this time. Park up there, cause Stretch and them will be setting all these. And uh, empty out the bags along the way. We'll empty out the bags all the way to the front. Hopefully this will be the last of them. We got what, 20, 40, you said 56. You've been doing okay though, huh? Yeah, I've been doing Okay, so maybe 60, I'll get, that's four more than what we said. And uh, you're still doing pretty good. 
We got fucking this dude over here breaking down the perfect size rock. Usually it's not that easy to break them, right? He, over here, he just breaks them in little pieces. What's your name, Vic? Daniel. Daniel? Yes, sir. Nice to meet you. How many stats? Hi, man. What's up, bro? Let's go. 19 plus 1? 19 plus 1, sir. Let's go. I'm bringing you a great man. <laughs> oh, yeah, Counted them. Double check, twist, double check. Because I mean, realistically, we, if we lose one bag, that's all it is. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Yeah? I need two more. Sure. Yeah. Two more? So we got three. Come on, that's four, five, six, that's seven, eight. eight. Yeah, you guys. 18. Yeah, yeah, you need two more. Hey, we need two more over here, guys. There's only 18 right here. I got two. Oh, man. I love when like some, oh fuck. <laughs> nah, but uh, yeah, I love it like, you know, you, you think you got stuff rolling on time and uh, something clears up for you, so now you got even more time. Yeah. Getting love everywhere. That's like people That's like on the, the road. That's yeah. like four people today. I'm kind of liking my other way, but I'm taking it this way. But not downwards, Bob. Go bam. Bam, bam, bam. You got me? I was right there with you. Shit, I went the wrong way. That's good. Switched up the whole plan right now. Yeah, I saw it in your head. You did? Or I saw it in, you saw it in my head, Ricky? In your eyes. What are you doing looking in my head? <laughs> hey, I just changed the whole plan right now because I forgot about Shane. Yeah, so we're going to leave Joel here with the barrel because I was mad at myself for not going to get the barrel right now. But I changed up the whole plan anyway because what I want is you and G to go to Shane's to make it look good. We're getting it done. We're going to, you know, pretty much get most of it done. Uh, we won't be finished today, but we'll get most of it done. Yeah, yeah. And then we'll come back tomorrow, knock that out. These posts will be all set. I'll come back and check on these guys. And I'll bring uh, any, any more concrete if we need it. I got 20 more bags. I don't foresee us needing more. Maybe seven bags at the most. You know what I'm saying? Because the way that it's going, calculating it, it's 85 holes. We're using, you know, three bags per four holes, basically. That's what we used in the beginning of these three bags. A bag on two holes right now. A bag on two holes? Yeah. So that's, that's even better than the other odds. Bag on two holes and that's two bags, four holes? That's as long as I stay. He stays putting as much rock as I'm having him. Oh, uh -huh. and making a leave, soupy? Yeah, if I leave and he stops fucking doing the rock farming. So what do you want to do? Do you want to stay? No, no, I'm just trying to tell okay. him, like, hey. Joel, right? Yeah, Joel, as much rock as possible, just like we've been doing. But make know? it soupy so yeah. they set up solid. And honestly, that rock's gonna make this post heavy as fuck at the bottom, so it's not gonna... Yeah, it's gonna be solid as fuck. Who says stacks don't get dirty out here, dude? Who said that? Look at me. Look at me right here. Dirt. Ah. Uh, let me see. Yeah, look at that. You know, like seven more bags. See? That's exactly what I said. How many bags did I say? Mm -hmm. Seven more bags, did I not? Rewind that video! Seven bags at the most, you know what I'm saying? Well, I mean, to be on the safe side, though. Yeah. That's what I said. I think we're gonna need about seven more bags. Because here at A Plus, we don't like to skimp on concrete. We fill it all the way to the top. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? All right, one, let's stay here. You guys are gonna mix up, set, you, Ryan, and Joel. G, you're rolling with stretch. You guys are gonna go do this welding job, finish it up, six sections. Shouldn't take too long. And uh, yeah, rock and roll. Yes, Ryan, you're staying for the day, right? Yes, sir. Okay, cool. Uh, and obviously, if you wanna come back tomorrow too, man. But yeah, just keep going, man. Keep rolling down. Y'all got all the bags. I'll come back with seven more, just so we make sure we have enough. The goal is set all these posts and rake out all the dirt. And it don't matter because we have this ugly ass field back here. So really you can just rake all the dirt over to the field. It don't matter. Just make basically our fence line where all this dirt and shit looks like shit. Make it look nice and smooth and clean on our side. The field doesn't matter, you know? Obviously trash and shit don't do that, but just the mud yeah. and stuff like that. But yeah, we want to have our side clear all the way down. That way we have, uh, you know, no, nothing fucking with our boards, our two by fours and stuff like that when we lay them out. Keep the boy looking dirty right really. It's working. I have all the concrete on my legs and shit. Yeah. This ain't even really working too much. I just took a little bit here and there. It's baby shit compared to me out here, shirt off. And that shirt comes off? We about to get dirty. <laughs> and sweaty. Sweaty, dirty. Where's stretch go? 
Hey, what's up, brother? What's up, big dog? Shit, I got the shirts and the whip. Right. How you doing? I didn't know y'all inside. What's going on, How you doing? How's everything? Good, bless me. What's up, bud? What's up, bro? Stacks, man. Jared, nice Good to meet you, Jerry. Oh, what's up, what's up brother? Danny. My man, Danny. What's up, brother? Good to meet you. Yeah, hell yeah. I see you. Story hey, let me get your shirts real quick, big dog. But yeah, I don't know if I need much right now, bro. I think I'm good on everything. I just came here to show some love, meet these guys, bring some teas. You the XL? Uh, no, that's It's your sponsor. There you go, big dog. Here's that large. Thank you, bro. Hell yeah, I appreciate you guys, man. My man. I get Appreciate the love. Yeah, let's get a pity. Yeah, I appreciate y'all watching the channel, man, showing love. Hell yeah. Appreciate you appreciate coming out. Of course, bro, yeah. I'm glad I got to work out, man, because they canceled my appointment, like, literally a couple hours ago. And I know you said, so. you know that I'll wait a little bit. Yeah. And then you said it canceled. I said, all right, we'll hold, we'll hold yeah. it. It worked out, bro. Hell yeah. Come in. Yes, sir. Keep hitting them weights, man. Yes, sir. What's up, guys? Yes, How you up, doing, man? bro? Stacks. Nice to meet you, man. Good to meet you, homie. I see you on TikTok you know all the time, man. Oh, yeah, on TikTok. Oh, yeah. Nice up, to meet you, man, Stacks, good to meet you, brother. Good to meet you, too, nice brother. Nice to meet you guys. Oh, yeah. All right, man, we're going to get out of your hair, man. If you guys need anything, let me know. All right? Tyler, see you later, Joseph. Later, bro. Have a good day. 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 Have a Attach back together, maybe. Use this, cut it, block it, whatever you need to. Use that, cut it, block it. Cool, so yeah, I got it. Right side, one pose, reattach six, and reset one, two. So, hey, look, what we do is we reset both of those, replace that one. Reset two on the right line. Reset two, replace one. Hey, you're all talking about the way. You sound like big girl. Tell that big girl, dude, you got your hair all standing up. I'm outside. Man, Own right up here. to what you said, dog. I did. Own you're up 270. to what you said and throw This hands, is what homie. you gonna get right here over and over again. Put the shade down. Are you done? Throw it on the I'm ground. I'm gonna get my Own drink, homie. <laughs> Come outside. Yeah, I'm in that lobby. You in that lobby. Oh. Are you been eating good, so I'm, I'm gonna say... I'm gonna say 208. 208? I'm gonna say 210. 210? I wanted to go 210, but... But you went to desecrate it. 210. I said 280. I'm going to desecrate it. <laughs> it's like the price is right. When you're like a dollar over, you know. Don't matter, but if you're under, you're up. Exactly. Don't even it, Ricky. <laughs> Just think the fucking price is right. You're talking about my life here. <laughs> Bro. I need y'all be here. Damn. God, dude. 14 pounds in less than a week? No. Yeah, something like that. Something like, like that. 10 pounds? It's growing season. <laughs> I gotta get back on that fucking uh, that boxing, bro. That boxing can be lean, mean, <laughs> sex machine. I know. That's good. <laughs> People were liking the bag. Oh, the Stax Army bag? Yeah. What? I got it coming soon. Oh. We got so much coming soon. People aren't even ready for it. They're not ready for it. That's why I can't tell all y'all right now because there's so much it's just gonna blow your mind, alright? I don't wanna do that to you, that's not who I am. I could have kept going. I'm just warming that back up. Let me know I'm coming for it. You know what I'm saying? There ain't nothing it can do to stop me. If you don't warm up your your uh your muscles, you end up straining them, you know what I mean? It's always about mind the muscle connection, get the blood to that muscle, but before you do that, you gotta stretch it. Do something light, something rep repetitive. That way you get your joints going. That's why I'm always doing triceps on, on chest day, because I always want my elbows to be nice and warm when I start doing presses, you know what I'm saying? And I never told you that. Write that down, that's a free tip. Warm up those joints before you do anything. Don't just go in and just start lifting. One, two, 
three, you want to warm the joints up, always. Are you ready for this? Coming soon. Let's go, baby, pre-workout. It's in the testing phases. Trying to bring, bring you guys a, a flavor that you're going to like, flavor that I'm going to like, because I'm going to be taking it. You know what I mean? Every day, every workout, it's going to be the let's go, baby, pre-workout. You ain't going to be ready for it. You're feeling like an animal. The focus, the caffeine's perfect. It's all together the perfect mix, guys. Formulated by yours truly and a good friend of mine. Killing it, killing it. Way better than any other pre-workout on the market. In my personal opinion. What's up, big dog? I'm gonna interrupt you, man, good, but, but it's my last day in San Antonio, so I wanted to talk to you. Oh yeah, what you mean? Uh, I, I just told my brother too uh, that I saw your video, and I was like, that looks like Crunch. I bet he works out at Crunch. Yeah, so by doubt, I'm never gonna see him. Yeah. Then I come today. Today's my last day. When I see you. Uh, I got a favor, Derek. Yes. Oh yeah. Yeah. Nice to meet you. I got a favor to ask about. I don't know if you have a marker. Would you ask for a marker? Yeah. But I have my belt right here, and I saw the whole beef and stuff with you, a big boy. Yeah, yeah. Whoa. I was a fan of his and everything, you know, and I saw you and all that. I went out to two things. Of course. And I don't want to deal You're with not that. Not with anymore. the fake cartel no more. Yeah, so yeah, I, 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 actually, I have his signature on there. I was going to personally scratch it out, but I didn't have a marker. Yeah, yeah. But if you want to do it. Yeah, I have, I have his up there and then Pitbull's. Oh, yeah, Pitbull's cool. I got no beef with him, I don't even know him. Yo, so where you from? I'm from the valley. The valley? Yeah. And yeah, uh, I was in Las Vegas and I saw in the mirror, I was like, Daddy. Yeah. I was like, oh man. Yeah, I didn't yeah, want to interrupt, I didn't want to interrupt the shooting. Ah, you're good, good, homie. Now we show love to everybody, bro. Shows love. And you'll be on the YouTube now. Yeah. And we'll be crossing this shit out on the YouTube. Oh, yeah. Good. Hell yeah. So uh, the belt is warm like this. They rolled it upside down, but he's smart to do it. Even better, yeah. I'm just gonna sign right over it. Stacks, baby. Look at that. Oh, yeah, I Eric, hell yeah, homie. I appreciate you, big dog. Appreciate the love. Thank you. you saw that one? My man. Good to meet you. If you want to get a picture or whatever, let me know. Yeah, uh, you got my phone? Let me get a pump real quick first. Yeah, you good. I'll come back. Oh, yeah. Stacks Army now, homie. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You want to pick two, bro? Yeah, I'll take one. My man, let's go. You both from the valley, huh? Yeah. yeah. Well, he's he's living in San Francisco. Yeah. Okay, and then you're going to Colorado? Yeah. So when you, uh, you come back, you go back to your family in the valley or what? No, this is my last day uh, on my leave. So I'll be taking over there if I get four years. Four years? Yeah. Oh, shit. Ran into Stacks right before yeah. he left. That said inspiration right there. Yeah. Oh, man. Hell yeah. What was your name, bro? Devin. Devin and Derek. Easy enough. <laughs> I appreciate you. Good to be here. Feeling strong today. I even told uh, Asana I wouldn't go heavy or I wouldn't go crazy. I mean, they're like, raw. <laughs> All red. Straining everything. Never do four plays all of a sudden. <laughs> Not too heavy. You know that I can do triple this. I knew you got bigger though. Oh, still kind of lean. Yeah. For 214, your boy's still kind of lean. Mean. Sex machine. Thumbnail it and rode to 270. Yeah, rode to 270. For real. <laughs> Dude, like a good, 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 like blow me up. Oh, yeah. Just to talk shit. <laughs> yeah. We rode to 270. That was a good one. You <laughs> were like, what the hell? He's gonna do it. He's gonna do it. And I'll be like, guys, I would never get that bad. <laughs> yeah, that would be weird. I would be ginormous. Rode Your punches would be like, how would I be in a punch, bro? I punch myself with my own bicep. <laughs>
You can build it back more? Yeah, we do the reverse of that. I think your, your lats more. It helps also helps that curve. bicep, right? Yeah, it's a secondary, but yeah. all back, this helps bicep. Yeah, okay. So this, you know, it just depends on how you're using your body. You're not supposed to be using your arms while you're doing the pull down. I mean, you are, but you're supposed to be focusing on the squeeze of your lats and the stretch. The squeeze, the stretch. Using only this as a secondary muscle. Of course, you gotta use your reverse hit right here from behind. We're supposed to. I feel that bitch right here, right here. Yeah, it's out from your lab, but it's also your upper back too. Like in here, right here, right here, right here. I feel it here and here. Those two spots. You can see exactly on my through my muscle groups exactly what it is. Are you here? Right here, wide. Shows, I guess. You know, <laughs> it's, it's the back of your lats. Your upper traps, and your, your, mid, your top upper lumbars, all that squeezes behind your leg. But it's also good for your delts and shit too. But I just like how it feels right here, homie. That's, that's, that's the you only. You should be getting a better stretch right there for your lats by doing the front. Ah, this is where I get the best stretch right here. Oh, yeah. That's how I blew my whole back up in prison. Pull ups, bro, all day, every day. Pull ups, pull ups, pull ups, pull ups. Look at that shit, baby. Look at that shit. Look at that shit. Sweat dripping down the fucking arms. Mind up muscle connection. Make the last one count. Uh, every fucking rep, baby. Mind to muscle. Sweat like a motherfucker, right? Mm -hmm. That ain't no oil on me either. I didn't put no spam on my ass. Is it Pam? Pam. Both. No spam or pan. You know what Cali does with spam. You know. Nobody in my, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. I'm not gonna risk, like I tell everybody, I'm not gonna risk even trying to go toe to toe with someone like that. Like, I'm a smart motherfucker, not a dumb motherfucker. I don't care about what people, you would have had heart. I'm like, shit, I got plenty of heart. 
in my own eyes. I don't care if you think I got heart. But I mean, you know, you can't make all these youngsters understand the streets. Yeah. And that's usually who the ones that are making the dumbass comments. You yeah. know what I mean? Little, uh, what do you call them, Rick? Trolls? Trolls. Yeah. Hey, this is the second time I ever seen you in my life. Yeah, hey, yeah. I can tell you, after going back watching everything, the vibe we had the first time I met you, man, man. it's all been one hundred. I don't know yeah. nothing about old boy, but hey, my man. I already know. You know yeah, yeah. I appreciate the love, man. Yeah, yeah I mean, honestly, like you were saying too, man, like, you change everybody, you good people, man. He yeah. gonna bring you around if you weren't. Yeah, I appreciate you know I mean? that. Yeah, yeah. I appreciate, appreciate you, you not going to Hollywood and acting fly here. Oh, nah, <laughs> yeah, you already know, homie. Yeah, All right, sure. guys. I'll see you later, guys. Yes, sir. Good to see you, yeah, man. Good to see you, man. All right, good to see you. So, Rap Baby, another mean-ass back day with your boy Stax. It's been a minute, guys. I'm feeling good. This is two days strong. It's been a long time since we've gone two days in a row, huh, Rick? Monday. Monday and Tuesday? Usually it's like Monday. Uh, Tuesday, I got some stuff I got to do. Uh, Wednesday. Uh, maybe we go Wednesday, but maybe Thursday. Yeah, it's been like that recently, guys, but it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? It's all about the consistency, not giving up, still coming, even if you miss that one day that week, even if you miss four days that week, you got to come back, man. You can't quit. If you quit, then everything you've already done is getting you nowhere. You know what I'm saying? Because you're just going to gain it all back or you're going to lose all the muscle you put on. So you got to be consistent, guys. Consistency is the key. You already know. That's my motto. Chip away, keep your head down, go to work, come to the gym, go home, go wake up, go to work, go to the gym, go home every fucking day. No excuses, no motherfucking breaks, baby. You already know. Guys, make sure you follow the homie Big Guy. Make sure you follow the Stacks Army page. Go show some love on my TikTok, even though I'm never on it. Show some love on the Snapchat, even though I'm never on that. Show some love on the YouTube. Subscribe, comment in that motherfucker. Show some love, show some hate. We got lots of haters now from that snake cartel, snitch cartel, fake cartel, whatever it is. But, uh, you know, we appreciate the hate, man. As my boy Rich would always say, love the haters because you're still making me money. Comment below. Appreciate the love and support from all the Stacks Army, baby. If you haven't yet, go cop that new Stacks Army tee. We got a bunch of Stacks Army merch at StacksArmy.com. I appreciate all you guys. All the love and support has been overwhelming. I know where my army's at, baby. Go check out the merch, because if you ain't rocking that Stacks Army merch, you ain't Stacks Army. Let's go.